The life of the First Lady is spent in the spotlight. From Eleanor Roosevelt to Michelle Obama, the First Lady is often a strong advocate for social change. Thus, many people wondered how Melania Trump would fare after her husband was elected president in 2016. The incredibly private model from Slovenia has become the most photographed woman in the world. And like her husband, she's managed to stir up a few controversies herself. But many people are still wondering, what's it like to live a day in the life of First Lady Melania Trump? Before we explore the daily routine of Melania Trump, make sure you subscribe to The Richest, hit the like button, and leave a comment if you want to see more videos like this one. Now here's a glimpse into the secret life of Melania Trump. Wake up! Just like everyone else in the world, Melania Trump needs a good night's sleep. That's why she starts most mornings waking up in her own bedroom. While this sleeping arrangement has provided ammo for the media, White House officials insist this is due to their conflicting schedules. The president starts his day at 5.30 a.m., but the first lady prefers a little extra beauty sleep. And who can blame her? The last president and first lady to sleep separately, John and Jackie Kennedy. A light workout Continuously admired for her great figure and stunning beauty, the former model insists that she only does minimal exercise. The first lady normally starts her day with a smoothie or oatmeal and aims to eat seven pieces of fruit each day. Her favorite light exercise is walking around the house in ankle weights. For a more intense workout, she plays tennis and does Pilates. Taking her son to school Melania Trump is well known for being an active parent. She considers motherhood her full-time job and attracted lots of attention when she refused to move into the White House in January 2017. The First Lady defended her stance, saying she wanted to let her son finish out the school year. This arrangement was estimated to cost millions of dollars per month in security, since the First Lady and her son took a Secret Service caravan to school. This disturbed Manhattan traffic as the police would barricade the roads every morning to allow Melania and Barry through. In summer 2017, the First Lady kept her end of the deal and moved her and Barron into the White House. Attend Meetings As anyone with a high-profile job, Melania spends a lot of time in meetings. Just like her predecessors, the First Lady has set forth a public awareness campaign. While Michelle Obama targeted childhood obesity, Mrs. Trump is supporting children and mothers who are battling addiction problems and cyberbullying. Part of her job as First Lady is to sit down with specialists and leaders in these fields. Together they launch awareness campaigns and policy briefings. Through this campaign, she hopes to empower women and help reverse the effects of cyberbullying, something her husband may need help with. Decorate the White House one of the First Lady's more traditional roles is that of an interior designer. It's well known that the First Lady gets to handle the decor of the President's residence. She has a say in everything from upholstery to china. Last year, the Flotus showed off her style by decking the halls of the White House for Christmas. While she is normally praised for her style, Melania was ridiculed for her creepy choice of decor in 2017. But Christmas isn't the only time she gets to show off her decorating skills. The First Lady also gets to plan dinners when hosting major events at the White House. Public Appearances as an official representative of the United States of America, the First Lady's presence at public events is often expected and requested. Whether it's accompanying the president or flying solo, the job of Flotus is directly in the public spotlight. But Melania Trump is more private than those who came before her. Hailing from Slovenia, many people believe her European upbringing is the reason for her reticence. However, that doesn't stop her from doing her job. She hosted the White House's annual Easter egg roll, a state dinner for the French president and his wife, and a press conference to launch her Be Best campaign. She also attended the funeral of former First Lady Barbara Bush in lieu of the president. Greeting Son After School Continuing to be the ever-present mom that she is, the First Lady always wants to help her son with his homework. After the election, Donald Trump's family was caught up in a whirlwind of responsibility. Having to relocate to Washington, D.C., Melania was worried about her son's education. And despite being a private person, she's proud to be a mother. The First Lady says she's always there to help Barron with his homework in the afternoon, and she's always willing to attend school functions. Family Time 
Being the first family of the United States, it's often difficult to find any downtime. With their busy schedules, it's not surprising that President and First Lady Trump have been spending little time together. So little time, in fact, that the media is constantly speculating on the nature of their relationship. This news, along with numerous awkward encounters between the two, have many people wondering how happy the nation's first couple truly is. But a close family friend insists that Donald, Melania, and Barron spend nearly every evening together as a family. Then, each returns to his or her own separate bedroom to rest up for a new day. Unless, of course, they're traveling around the world. Well, there you have it, a day in the very secretive life of Melania Trump. What are your thoughts on the First Lady? Leave us a comment down below. And don't forget to subscribe to The Richest. Thanks for watching.